Day sports coverage of the National Football League is on the air. Just a short time ago, smoke from the pyrotechnics filled the dome as the Colts made their way out of the locker room. We're set for football as the Colts get set to match up with the Dallas Cowboys. Quite make it to the 25. So the Colts now coming out for their opening drive. And leading them, Charles, their quarterback, their field general. Hey. They're going to look to throw. It's brought in by Harris. Here's second and eight. They'll set up a throw. This to the outside for Mack. On play action, they'll throw. This will be taken in by Michael Pittman. They'll run on first down with Marlon Mack. And they'll get this down to the 10. They'll look to throw here. For the end zone. But you've got to get the ball from them. Yeah, win that turnover battle is going to be key. They didn't get one there, but you get the feeling. The teams think they come in bunches. Blankenship's kick is good. Points were put on the board. Now we'll see what the right arm of Dak Prescott has in store as the Dallas Cowboys offense sets up shop. And he ought to have a lot of pep in his step out. Prescott now. And brought in by the tight end Cook. Now Prescott. He finds his man complete. That's Cook. On first down. Elliott. Zeke with a shake and bake. And he takes. Prescott to throw it. Nowhere to go here. He lost the football. Nothing after one on EA Sports. Zerline's kick is up and through. Confident quarterback, and to play that position, you have to be. You just act like there's something wrong with the wind currents or something. Oh, what a juke into space. And able to rip off a big run on that last play. Yeah, they didn't get a first down, but still, you'll take runs like that each and every time, won't you? Here's a pass swung out left to his running back. When you get out in open field, sometimes you get a little loose with it as you're trying to get up ahead of steam. Make sure you keep it close to your body because the defenders are trying to punch it free. He does. On second down, here's a run with Mack. And he takes this one in for a first touchdown. Marlon Mack with touchdown number eight on the year. And that going to be taken in by Ashton Doolby, third and six. Prescott. They'll set up the screen to Elliott. And he's got the first down yardage. Whenever you're getting a lot of heavy pressure towards your quarterback, that's when you're thinking about running the screen and using that pressure against the defense. Oh, he put on the carpet, a fumble. And the Colts pick it up. And they will set up shop at their own 41-yard line. Take a second and look at this just to make sure. Now the question, was the knee in fact down before this ball comes loose? And is the video convincing enough to overturn it? A lot of factors here. Remember, you also need clear possession of football out. And to review the play, the right on the field is reversed. Here's Prescott. Open man lamb. It's complete. On first and ten, Prescott. And he's going to be taken down here. A sack back at the 32. Jadevian Clowney. Plays himself, as we just saw there. Now on third and long, they'll look to throw. And he is not going anywhere. He will not even get back to the line of scrimmage as the... And Zerline's kick is good. Here's a play fake as they set up to throw. Looking for Campbell downfield. And that is caught. One-handed. Oh, my. Pulled it in. A good play there for Andy. Well, it's one thing to grab it with one hand, but when you make a catch of that distance, quite another. Yes, sir. I mean, that one right there, we keep talking about 
the high-flying antics that we're seeing just outside the red zone. They'll look to throw again. He dumps this off to Mack. And down inside the first down, that leads to a second and ten. Now here's a... Back to throw again. Eluding the pressure right. To the goal line, but it's incomplete. The field goal team now for the second time here today. And that is no good. It comes with 22 seconds to go here at half number one. Throwing again on second down. Prescott. And they're going to have this across midfield and in. And again, it's Prescott. And this one complete to Doolin. And he's going to get this down near the 30-yard line before halftime. It'll be a 47-yard attempt from the left hash. And this one is going to just tuck into the bottom left corner. So we hit halftime here in Indianapolis with the Colts on top. As we'll head down to Orlando, that's where we find our man Jonathan Coachman at our EA Sports Halftime Report. Coach. All right, Brandon, thanks very much. Things definitely getting interesting around the NFL as we begin this game. And you know what I think the defense is saying back to them? Why don't you guys focus on getting some first downs, put some drives to get side run, run with toughness now, hopefully get to the perimeter later, and let's face it, you could do worse than a four-yard run on first down. Essentially being a receiver downfield. It's very difficult, especially if the running back has skills like a receiver who can match up with him without weakening our overall defense. You're exactly right. It's a tough task to match up to him. Uh, even on that one, there was a little bit of a hole, but it closed there quickly at the end. And he's got his man on the out route. He's up third. And I think what they've done is they put doubt in the minds of the offensive guys. Touchdown, Cowboys! A great play there! Who gets lost sometimes? The back in the backfield. That's exactly what happened there. And he got into the end zone. And he will get into the end zone to extend the lead by two more. He hits. Here's Mack to get it again on second down. Unable to corral him. He fights through. And pass the foot. They'll run it out of the gun with Mack. And he'll be brought down. It looks like what? They'll look to throw here on first down. They'll set up the screen to Taylor. And some room to work. And they'll wind up getting this with all necessary risks. But you try and find a way to get back to what you were doing earlier in the drive in order to finish this one off. And that almost hit him right there, but at least it does get him to fourth down. Well, this at least is the right idea. I think they've got to get the tight end more involved. And now on third down. They'll look to throw. And he'll be brought down by the Colts. This season, still a couple chapters left in that book, though. Now a man open down the middle of the field. Now a play fake here on first down. He'll take a shot downfield for Pittman. And this is, oh my goodness, he pulled it in one-handed. It'll be first and goal when we come back. You are watching the NFL on EA Sports. He tried to get something out of it by dumping it off to his running back unsuccessfully. Now a second down throw. Attempts to the end zone. Now what do you think they're going to try and dial up on third and goal? Well, knowing them and knowing what we've just seen, I think they're throwing it again, don't you? I think you have. Game here, trailing in the final quarter and going for it on fourth and goal. He'll find a man over the middle. It's Pittman. A great open field tackle is going to stop him shy of the goal line. They're turned to him with second and a yard. Going to run again here with Pollard. And he'll be a couple yards. Second and five now. Prescott got an open man, the tight end, Jarwin. Here's Prescott. The Colts are going to get him. Down he goes. DeForest Buckner gets his 20th sack of the season as he continues. Ended up getting a little too much jersey and hooked the guy, hence the flag. And throwing here to start the drive as they can. I could have really made something out of that one. And this is going to be a Colts first down. It's on third down. Three for seven so far in this game. This is third and ten. 
He's got his target, Harris. Out of the gun. Here's a give to Matt. And it'll be a little shot. They're going to look to throw. And he'll find Pittman. Here's Taylor again. And he'll get into the end zone. Touchdown, Indianapolis. Jonathan Taylor. His sixth touchdown of the season. And the Colts are facing a critical third down now, needing a score here in the late going. Quick hitter here, it's complete. Prescott. Complete. Pollard. And he slips up pass down now, but the clock continues to move. Meanwhile, Prescott's throw taken in by toward a minute to go in this football game. Now Prescott. Going underneath, complete to Jarwin. And they'll have it in the red zone. Prescott urging his guys to go quickly. They need to get up and set. And he's got it. And he couldn't quite get there. Gunning four on first and goal. Here's Dak. And he can't get a throw off. He's taken. They'll run left with Pollard. And they'll get this from the 18. Defensive tackles because we ask them to just eat up blocks and allow other people. And the 10 year vet knocks it through the goal post. They'll try and start this drive in the air. Looking for a Campbell downfield. And that is incomplete. Took a shot there on first down, but he couldn't reel it in. It's a little teaching moment here. Overtime rules. Remind us how this goes, partner. Okay, so in the past, we had sudden death. First team to score wins, but no longer. Now, if the team receives the ball, scores a touchdown, they win the game. If they kick a field goal, though, or don't score, the other team gets a possession. Job as long as you want one in this league, won't you? I mean, let's face it's not just West Coast offense either. He's putting the ball downfield as well. Again, it's Cooper as he makes the catch. The completion good for only six, and that'll bring up four. Together, looked like there was an opening. Still, ended up with a solid game. And he's able to take this one away. Taylor. And he'll be taken down, but not before he works it past the 50. And 20 now after the holding penalty. On play action, they'll throw. Finds his big tight end, Mo Alley Cox. On third down, Samson. He's got the first down here inside the 30. And he's into the end zone for the touchdown. time to decide this one the rushing score and OT finishes it off but all throughout really just a great game to witness I agree and it's the way this game went the ebb and flow of it all and then to get there and finish it what I would call an old school way a running play because in today's NFL we throw the ball to ring the bell don't we <laughs> not there they ran it in and again just a great great game that we bore witness to so for Indianapolis, they continue to keep pace for that first round bye as they move to 11 and 1. And they will hit the road next week for a date with the Cleveland Browns. Meanwhile, for Dallas, it's a tough one to swallow as they drop back to 8 and 4 on the year. And they'll try to turn things around next week as they have a matchup in New Orleans against the Saints. So that'll do it for us, for my partner, Charles Davis, and all the hard-working men and women on our crew. I'm Brandon Gaughan. You've been watching the NFL right here on EA Sports. The Colts are winners as we say so long from Indianapolis.